What's going on? Mike Newman here with Inside Natural Body, building the conclusion of the Amateur Open Men with the newest IFPA Pro, Richard Balabri. Richard, uh, what class are you in first and foremost? Open. You're open, what, uh, medium, tall? Medium. You're in the medium class. Okay, we got two stages. This show is so damn big, there's two stages going on. We got pros and some amateurs on this side, amateur open guys are on this side, so I couldn't catch everything. I said I did see your pre-judging, so I knew you were in the but you had a lot of tough competitors in that show. And when you win your pro card at the show like the KC Classic, you know you're ready for a pro stage right now. So I mean, what do you think you're gonna do with this pro card now? You're gonna take some time off and put some size on, or are you gonna test your waters at a show uh, like in Georgia in a couple of weeks? Just to see, just to see what you can do. Just to see, what you might as well. You're in shape. You can see where you stand. Okay, and you'll find out real quick where you stand with the pros. Okay, and uh, who knows? You might get a, a, a York Cup qualification, nonetheless. So, how many years you been competing for? This is my first. Your very first show. Okay, well that's uh, I didn't know that either. I don't know too much about you. I know you're uh, one of Chidi Ekber's clients. I heard a little bit about you. I didn't know it was your debut, and it's very rare that you see a guy win his pro card in his pro debut. So you must have nailed everything right on target. So Chidi must have been over posing with you and everything. Because uh, you don't win a pro card without doing your homework. So how many weeks did you take to prepare for the show? Six weeks? So he keeps looking at Chidi Ekeberry. Let's bring Chidi into the show since we're talking about free contest here. Chidi Ekeberry, you must be a proud, uh, <laughs> proud trainer here. Okay. <laughs> Here. This is Chidi Ekeberry. This guy can Big probably, guy. first and foremost, give Liz Camp Schroeder a cameo appearance, Kayla. You gotta give her a cameo appearance. She's competing, <laughs> she's competing in the Bradley show on October 20th. Go check her out, I'll be there. But here's her cameo appearance. Yeah, Last week. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. So Chidi Ekeberry probably could have ripped the shirt off and competed in today's show, but he's gonna wait. But he's within striking distance. He's not letting us know where it's at, but Chidi. Yeah. So, how did you come across Richard? Where'd you find him at? How'd you discover him? And was it your idea for him to compete, or did he come to you on to compete? Well, um, I really started working with Richard about, uh, off and on about a year ago. Yeah. Uh, he kind of come in, you know, uh, work out yeah. but I've been working with him for a very long time, right. like two years. And I think Richard, you know, over time, he was more afraid of this all the changes. Yeah. His girl was able to make. And, uh, and then I worked with another client of mine who actually competed in the side of State Classic. Okay. And he did, uh, he did fabulous, you know. Most, okay. Uh, great athletes, and he came, he, he came out on top. So uh, I think he works at the same place, which I works at. So Richard actually kind of spoke to the guy and uh, he got a contact with me. So he came down to the studio with okay. the Impact Fitness, North Kansas City, one of the best gyms out there. Sure. In North Kansas City. I was a dad in Northern Park, you know, at the Jewish Premier Center. It's also one of the best places to okay. get the train, you know, in South Kansas City. So gotcha. he came down with a little consultation and you know, he told me he wanted to get into bodybuilding. Okay. He admired, you know, a lot of clients was it. So, right. you know, we sat down and kind of put things in place. I told him I think you know, you do it for what it takes, it's all work. Okay. So, uh, that's the only way I so you had an interest, okay. Now, okay, so you had the interest in it. What's the first, did, did you have to put some size on him first, or did you have to chisel him up and get him in shape? What was the first change you had to make for Richard well, here? you know, uh, Richard is one of these guys that is just naturally good. Yeah, I can and tell. For the most part, you know, he had a whole lot of muscle on him. He has the most majority of his body. Rip that shirt off real quick. Don't the fans see because it's clothes. It doesn't do you any justice. They think you're just a skinny guy. So look how ripped this guy is. Conditioning certainly won the show today. Give him a back shot real quick. Okay. Chidi, you want to give a, a pose down to this kid real quick or no? Huh? No, he, not, got, he got me okay. big right now. Okay. Uh oh, he got him big. Okay. fat right now. Well, that's the newest IFPA pro right there, Richard Delivery. So keep an eye out for him. So this is going to take some time off. So what improvements do you think Richard has to make before he jumps on the pro stage? Well, you know, uh, we, uh, we, we actually died for this competition for about 16 weeks. We really didn't get it serious until okay. because usually what I do with my competitive clients is to kind of break, break down the phases of the diet. Yeah. So the nutrition you know, first is to kind of get his body okay. you know, to kind of slowly get into the whole thing. Yeah. So we got a very serious diet. So gotcha. that's basically what I did. I think over time, you know, he of course, you know, he still has some, you know, improvements to make. They all have improvements to make. As far as I'm concerned, yeah. uh, his improvement has to be a little more because you yeah. can't say, okay, well, I'm just going to focus on that. Certainly. Sure. You know, the focus should be a little more on improvement. That's the way I'm going to buy it. So, uh, you know, he, he's a little potato, kind of, you know, maybe a little bit of a show. Yeah, he's 
we just going to sit down and kind of talk about it. Even myself, you know, I'm thinking about doing the Georgia. You know, now September 29th. You know, he got a pro car, so I'm yeah. trying to, like, you know, maybe take my client. You know, that was the goal. With, with my client on the same yeah, stage. I think it would be a great news. It would be amazing to kind of, you know, make that happen. So we're we'll just going to sit down and kind of see what we're doing. Okay, well, surprise, just let us know. You might get a Yorton Cup qualification. I'll be at the Yorton Cup as the MC, so looking okay. forward to hopefully seeing you guys there. But Achibi Ekaber in the audience here, looking at his client, must be a proud trainer right now. So, uh, man, there's the man right, right there. <laughs> first IFPA Pro, Richard Belibri, check him out. Right so, until next time, you got Chidi Ekaber, Richard Belibri, your newest IFPA Pro at the KC Class. A huge show, huge turnout. 198 competitors this show had. Mike Newman's inside National Bodybuilding. We're out of here. Thanks for watching.